beautiful day. Bosch Arch joint testing, day two. For the last two days, we've been here at the Bosch Proving Grounds in Flat Rock, Michigan, uh, working with Bosch on a new uh, two-wheel ABS system for our KR GT1 motorcycle. I think we might have been under the same misconception a lot of people are about ABS, that it somehow detracts from the feeling of the motorcycle and the experience of riding a motorcycle. And what we've quickly learned is that that couldn't be further from the truth. Yeah, the brakes too. That's slippery. <laughs> the Arch Motorcycle was a dream, a chance to create a motorcycle purely from the passion and love for motorcycles. A legacy, you know, of a big American V-twin. The purity, that torque, that power, that cruising. We're improving the performance of that motorcycle. So with the lean angles, you know, the confidence in the turning. The motorcycle should perform, but it should also be beautiful, yeah? And so the opportunity to blend those things, a motorcycle that is art, performance, has a soul. And keeping the, the sound and the rawness and the connection and the thrill of riding. And the, the ABS comes in quick when you go low to high. Mm -hmm. It's not like When a... we talk about ABS brakes, sometimes people get this like look across their face like, oh no. You know, you're, gonna, you're putting something between me and the experience of riding a motorcycle. And after being here for two days, I can tell you unequivocally that's not what's happening. I would want the system to let me know when working. I'm in ABS. Yeah, I like this. If a rider is experiencing ABS working, then they are probably riding over the limits of that motorcycle had it not had ABS. And that's what we learned really quickly here. This technology doesn't introduce itself when you're riding and even pushing to the limit of the motorcycle. It introduces itself at the limits of what your brakes can do. Now imagine being in a panic situation, hitting instead of that, hitting some diesel fuel and trying to... Yeah, I mean, okay, so the, one of the things that I would take away really quickly from that is just how, how the bike stayed straighter. When that person decides to make that left hand turn on the yellow, on, it should be the yellow, but the red, you know? How, what happens when I grab that brake? What happens at that point on a bike without ABS is that the front tire and rear tire lock up. Your tires run out of traction. When the front tire locks up, the bike goes to the ground almost instantaneously. So the Bosch ABS system is measuring the pressure and modulating the pressure in five millisecond windows to limit the tire from locking and to keep the bike upright and stable. You can't argue with the facts that the motorcycle will stop faster and more stably than a non-ABS motorcycle, even with the most experienced riders. This gives you time and a moment to gain control, to have some stability. Your front end's not gonna wash out and you're gonna survive to ride another day. Your wash has a philosophy that we want to improve people's lives, we want to save lives, we want to prevent injuries. And we think ABS alone can prevent about 25% of accidents. Almost everybody within this organization, globally, uh, are riders. Uh, so there's no way we're going to design something that's going to take away uh, any of the fun. Our motto is invented for life, so we want to invent something that fits for, for the lives of riders. For those of us who love motorcycles, we, we can't live without them. So I think any time you can add some level of safety that absolutely does not diminish the experience, why wouldn't you do that? I'm really excited to be riding those Santa Monica mountains again, up the coast, PCH, into the mountains, in those turns, on those beautiful straightaways, and know that we have ABS and that I'll be safer it'll be a better motorcycle.